So let's take you through a selection of the best transitional luxury bags to add to your collection. Luxury, versatile bags that can take you from any day event to an evening soiree and still leave you looking elegant and glamorous. For most of our selection of transitional luxury bags, the luxury bag comes with a detachable shoulder strap, a perfect accompaniment that makes the luxury bag a good option to wear during the day. Then simply removing the strap and carrying the luxury bag in hand or as a clutch can take your luxury day bag to a glamorous evening piece. Some of our options work well with having a larger size in the luxury bag during the day and a smaller size of the same version of the luxury bag in the evening. But in most cases, the smaller medium sizes works all throughout the day from morning to evening. And at number one, we have the Dior Lady Dior bag. With prices starting at upwards of £4,100 for the mini size. Since its debut, the Lady Dior handbag has never stopped turning heads. The Lady Dior bag is un undeniably a classic bag, a bag fit for a princess. This iconic bag was actually endorsed and elevated by the style and elegance of a real life princess and became one of the favourite chosen in the accompanying bags of one of the world's most adored princesses. The original Lady Dior bag was debuted in 1994 under the creative director of Gianfranco Fur. The elegant bag was yet to be named and was officially called the Shushu, a French term of endearment which in English means favourite. Bernadette Chirac, France's former first lady, is said to have asked the world-renowned Dior to make a special item for Princess Diana for her visit to France as she wished to give her a unique gift for the occasion as a token of French culture. The house offered her the chouchou and it was created in leather for the first time and completed from start to finish in record time in a single night. The bag was presented to the princess at the inauguration of the Paul Cézanne exhibition at the Grand Palais in Paris. And Diana absolutely loved it from its first appearance and from that moment onwards. The Lady Dior made history and was catapulted to iconic bag status. The larger series was officially launched in 1996, paying homage to Princess Diana when the Dior Fashion House officially changed the name of the Shushu to the Lady Dior bag. The Lady Dior bag is one of the cornerstones of Dior Fashion House and imbues all the Dior house codes with its classic timeless design and luxurious, elegant silhouette. The Lady Dior is boxy and squarey with a rigid silhouette and features two structured arch top handles, logo charms adorned with the decorative, sparkling metal charm jewellery, each charm making up the four letters of the name Dior hanging from the handles. The hardware and the metallic charms is usually offered in gold or silver tone, which adds to the brilliance of the iconic bag. Limited edition includes champagne hardware or a light blend of pale gold. The hardware zippers and plaque also carries the initials of Monsieur Dior. The bag also comes with protective studded feet. The Lady Dior is also adorned with Dior House's signature canage motif. The canage pattern inspired by Napoleon's the third shares used by Christian Dior to welcome his clientele into his atelier at his first show in 1947. The Lady Dior bag has been reimagined and revitalised countless times. The Lady Dior bag is now available in five different sizes, ranging from the Lady Dior Micro, the Lady Dior Mini, which was introduced in 2015, the Lady Dior Medium, the Lady Dior Large and the Large Dior Lady Shopping Tote. This making the bag versatile, giving you more options to carry the bag over the shoulder as a crossbody, as well as in your arm. In essence, the Lady Dior bag has not changed over the years, but each season it is revitalised in different types of leather materials, from soft cast skin, sheep skin, to delicate embroidery and luxurious velvet, in addition to microfiber, satin, denim, and precious skins like python and crocodile. The Lady Dior bag is also available in a vast array of colours, standard, classic, and pastel colours also. There are also buy and tricolored versions in addition to the limited editions. With a few amendments and updates, the Lady Dior still remains one of the true classic and iconics from Dior. Synonymous with star elegance and beauty, the Lady Dior is rich in history and heritage. And at number two, we have the Chanel Coco handle bag. With prices starting at upwards of £4,000 for the mini size. Named after Gabrielle Coco Chanel, the Coco handle was first introduced in Chanel's Full Winter 2015 collection. The Coco handle has a more trapezoidal structured silhouette and features a top handle with a distinctive front flap. 
The cocoa handle was originally a seasonal bag that first became a staple Chanel classic. The Chanel cocoa handle is another bag said to be a cross between the classic flat and the Hermes Kelly, and is sometimes called the flat bag with handle. The Chanel cocoa handle bag imbues all the signature Chanel house codes, including the diamond and chevron quilts and styles, the interlocking CC logo with the twist clasp, the interwoven leather and chain strap, in addition to the signature Mona Lisa pocket on the exterior of the bag. Although featuring many similarities to the Chanel classic flap, the Chanel cocoa handle still stands its ground amongst the other popular Chanel handbag designs. The Chanel cocoa handle bag is a perfect transitional bag from day to evening. The Chanel cocoa handle comes in four sizes, a mini, small, medium and large. The medium and large are the most popular sizes that can see you through your day. As the cocoa handle bag also comes with a long chain and a single roll top handle, it gives the bag multi-purpose carrying options. Some options also offer a detachable chain strap across all sizes and models. The Chanel cocoa handle bag is available in an array of levers and materials and is commonly offered in a grained calfskin caviar leather, which is durable and scratch proof too. And they're also offered in the smooth lambskin, which has a nice shiny sheen, adding to the luxurious aesthetic of the bag. And the cocoa handle is also offered seasonally in tweed, velvet and other materials too. The Chanel cocoa handle is available in numerous colours, including black, primary colours, all colours under the rainbow, pastels and pattern combinations. The hardware element of the cocoa handle is typically offered in either gold tone, silver or liqueur metal. The Chanel cocoa handle bag opens up to a fabric lined interior, two compartments separated by either a zippered pocket for the medium and large sizes or a slip pocket in the small sizes. The Chanel cocoa handle in a small features a flat pocket at the back of the bag. In addition to the signature three slip pockets with the center pocket on the front side of the bag. The small Chanel cocoa handle is the most popular size, small enough for all your daily essentials. The Chanel cocoa handle bag has been such a success and an icon in its own right that it's now offered every season. The Chanel cocoa handle is a practical and functional fashion forward bag that will complement any wardrobe. The Chanel cocoa handle is truly a timeless piece that will never go out of style. And at number three, we have the Fendi baguette bag. With prices starting at upwards of £1,750 for the mini size. The Fendi baguette bag most definitely started off as an it bag of the season, but has now become a mainstay and a classic. The iconic bag made its debut in the 1998 Fall Winter Collection, thanks to its mastermind, Sylvia Venturini Fendi. Sylvia was asked to craft an accessory that reflected not only the DNA of the Fendi fashion house, but the spirit of minimalism of society at the time. The end product was anything but minimalistic. Instead, it was flashy, playful and unique, unlike anything else on the market at the time. The Fendi Fashion House was unsure of its size and functionality, but Sylvia wanted to move away from basic designs. So Sylvia stuck to her vision and trusted her instinct. Fendi sparked the rapid consumption of regular bags by introducing the baguette bag in numerous different designs. The baguette bag is a small, compact streamlined bag that comes with a short strap and the famous Fendi logo, easily adapted for different looks. The baguette is available in many different textures, styles and patterns, from floral sequins, shared mink and tribal beads, to skins and glittery details, and exclusive pieces, as well as the limited edition DIY baguette kits. Since the baguette debut, there has been more than 1,000 variations. The baguette was initially available in only one size, but with the relaunch of the baguette bag, additional sizes were added. We now have the micro nano size, which is supposed to be a charm for belts and bags. However, it now comes with a chain that allows it to be worn as a crossbody. The mini, which is sold with a stylish leather top handle, 
and a chunky long chain strap attached at the sides. The classic baguette, which can be worn or carried in many different ways due to the longer shoulder strap, with some variations also coming with a chain strap version as well as the top handle. The large baguette also comes with a second shoulder strap, but no chain version. Two other newer silhouettes include the Easy 2 baguette and the Flat baguette. And then there's also the Double baguette, inspired by the original baguette as well as the Pico version, a dual accessory suitable for carrying AirPod earphones. Although baguette bags are supposed to be different and unique, they do have the same distinctive feature and signature design elements that can be found on each bag. Every baguette is the same shape. All baguettes have a rectangular silhouette with a short shoulder strap. Also, each baguette has the same interlocking double F hardware logo on the front flap clasp, with different variations on the clasp. Sometimes the clasp is left plain or adorned with embellishments. The revival of the iconic bag has ensured it will forever remain a part of the Fendi fashion house. The Fendi baguette is a timeless, iconic, classic piece that will remain in the archive of Fendi iconic bags forever. And at number four, we have the Gucci Dionysus bag. With prices starting at upwards of £1,750 for the mini size. Shortly after Alessandro Michele was promoted to creative director, he debuted his first handbag for the Gucci fashion house, the Dionysus. Debuted and released in 2015, the Gucci Dionysus combines Gucci's historic house codes with a modern update. When first released, the Dionysus was offered in Gucci's original GG Supreme coated canvas combined with suede detailing but the defining feature of the Dionysus was the distinctive, striking, signature Tiger Heads closure hardware in a horseshoe shape, adorning the front of the bag flap, an instantly recognisable piece of jewellery. According to Greek mythology, Dionysus was the god of fertility, wine, celebration and dance with a hint of madness. And the Tiger Heads have been adapted from his story, in which Dionysus is said to have crossed a river on the back of a tiger sent to him by his father Zeus, which is why the body of water was also later named Tigris River. The antiqued metal horseshoe piece with tiger heads on the end with dual crystals of different colours can appear in silver, palladium and gold tones. The horse shape being an element that links back to Gucci's equestrian roots. The Dionysus has fast become another iconic Gucci bag with a design that speaks to Alessandro's philosophies surrounding culture and extravagance. The Dionysus bag is a structured clasp bag with a slightly trapezoidal boxy silhouette design that features a double flap and a convertible chain strap that is removable and adjustable only on the medium size. This makes the bag versatile so it can be worn at shoulder length or as a crossbody or even a clutch. The slide and chain also allows the bag to be used as the top handle. The Dionysus has been created in countless iterations and is available in many materials, both simplistic and striking materials, from suede, tweed and velvet to the original Gucci Gigi Supreme canvas offered in the classic beige colourway. In addition to matching or contrasting suede inserts on the front flap of the double flap, the Dionysus is also offered in many leathers and skins, from lizard to python skin, in addition to embroidered options, from the snake design to the bees, birds and Gucci floral designs. There are also special editions of the Dionysus bag, including the Gucci Dionysus bamboo top handle with the web strap detailing. The Gucci Dionysus gives countless opportunities for innovation within the range and the Gucci Dionysus is offered in a variety of sizes including a medium, small, mini and super mini. The Gucci Dionysus bag also features a pin lock closure with a side release that opens the bag up to a microfiber suede looking interior lining and trifold accordion gussets on the side of the bag. The inside of the Gucci Dionysus bag 
is divided into three compartments with two open and one central zippered compartment. The medium size also features a slim side pocket on the back of the bag and a pocket under the flap, whilst the mini and super mini has one compartment and a zippered pocket. The Dionysus is a bag that can dress up any outfit. Among the most iconic Gucci bags of all times, the Dionysus continues to be coveted as a Gucci staple. The Gucci Dionysus is the perfect blend of Gucci's 70s glamour with a refreshing update. Whether you're looking for a timeless, elegant bag or just a trendy seasonal piece, the Gucci Dionysus bag is definitely a piece you should consider adding to your collection. And at number 5 we have the Bulgari Serpenty Forever Crossbody Bag. With prices starting at upwards of £1,950 for the extra small size. It is hard to resist the charm of the Serpenty Forever Bag from Bulgari. The Bulgari Fashion House is renowned for its understated elegance associated with the iconic snake design jewellery. Bulgari is a heritage brand founded in 1884 a well-renowned brand that has dressed fashion icons for decades. The Serpenty Head was first designed in the 1940s and symbolises rebirth, as a snake continually sheds its skin. It is said the Serpenty is a symbol of power and seduction, but it is also transformative. The first Serpenty bag was debuted in the 2012 Full Winter Collection. The beautifully crafted bag is adorned with a hypnotic snakehead closure and has firmly established its position as one of the highly coveted items in the fashion world. The fascinating representation of ancient wisdom and vitality embraced by Bulgari continues to mesmerize us season after season. Each Bulgari bag release as new colors to the latest Serpenty Forever bag collection. The Bulgari bag has a simple, solid, sturdy, rectangular or squarish shaped silhouette and is made vibrant by the subtle but daring serpent clasp, which is the main feature of the bag. Regardless of the plethora of styles, each and every Serpenty Forever bag features the luxe snakehead clasp. All snakeheads are made of enamel, with the alluring feature of the signature design being the eyes. They come in many stones like onyx, ruby and other precious stones. The Serpenty Forever bag has everything it takes to add a touch of glamour to any outfit with its additional jewellery flair. The Bulgari Serpenty Forever bag offers a structured top handle as well as a chain and leather shoulder strap which is removable and adjustable. The exterior features many layers of smooth calf leather and visible stitching patterns giving it a luxurious allure. The back of the Bulgari Serpenty for a bag is also adorned with the Bulgari logo script in gold. The Serpenty Forever bag opens up to a mixture of leather and fibre lined interior. The bag also opens up to a central compartment divided into three. In addition to internal pockets and another small open pocket on the back of the bag with a zip decorated with a snake head matching the one on the closure of the bag. The Serpenty Forever bag also features a dyed piping trim too. For some offerings, the Serpenty bag opens up to two compartments, and some Bulgari Serpenty Forever bags also have a lovely accompanying small Bulgari mirror inserted into one of the internal slip pockets or back pocket. The Bulgari Serpenty Forever bag comes in a multitude of styles and textures and colorways, from quilted to smooth leather or refined with chain around the edges. The styles and designs are endless. The prices of the Serpenty Forever bag can vary dramatically, but most stunning bags like the red ruby crocodile shoulder can reach the tens of thousands of pounds. No matter the style of the bag you get, the design elements transfer from each side of the bag, including the leather panels that sit atop the exterior of the bag. The Serpenty Forever bag is so versatile, allowing you to wear it as a clutch as well as a crossbody. Limited editions of the Bulgari Serpenty Forever bag also includes the duet with two flaps and the triplet with three flaps. Excellent craftsmanship goes into making the Bulgari Serpenty Forever bag 
as articians need to manipulate the lever and perfect the fine metal hardware and shape, and the flawless snake clasp that is the main feature of the bag. The Serpenty Forever bag is not just a bag, but a fantastic piece of art. And at number 6 we have the Fendi First Bag. With prices starting at upwards of £2,250 for the small size. The Fendi First Bag was first debuted in Fendi's Autumn Winter 2021 fashion show. As part of Kim Jones's first collection, after taking over in 2020 as Fendi's Artistic Director of Couture and Women's Wear. Kim Jones wanted to release the ultimate accessory that stood not just for Fendi, but also for his first collection in his own sense of style and evolution. A collection captured through the theme of Fendi's emblematic letter F, which in the Fendi world stands for family, fun, functionality, fur and form amongst other things. The brief of the bag was to interpret the signature Fendi F. So with the aid of Sylvia Venturini Fendi, the house's artistic director of accessories and menswear, Sylvia designed a low-key approach bag with a real modern twist to fit Kim Jones's brief. The new bag, the brainchild of Sylvia Venturini Fendi, was introduced with Kim Jones's ready-to-wear collection. The Fendi first bag was the masterpiece to represent this. The Fendi first bag fabulously showcases Fendi's innovation when it comes to creating fine luxury handbags, an example of Fendi's artisanal savoir-faire, premium craftsmanship and timeless innovations blended with functionality. Based on the style of the classic woman's clutch, but bringing in a new twist to the classic soft form clutch. The eye-catching feature of the Fendi first bag is the distinctive F metal embellishment. This grand emblematic tilted oversized F-shaped gold metal clasp adorning the top of the pouch with a pressed button closure mechanism. The tilted F is turned into the frame of the bag, forming a bag with an asymmetrical silhouette and soft puffy shape. This emblematic detail beautifully accentuates the bag's exterior and adds an alluring charm to the design. The F detail is very obvious when one opens the bag and views the clasp from the top view. It is a simple take on the Fendi logo with a very contemporary appeal. The interior of the bag is just as stunning as the exterior. The Fendi first bag opens up to an interior lined with either the iconic double F motif printed jacquard fabric or a smooth leather lining and is roomy enough to accommodate your day-to-day -day essentials. The Fendi first bag is also nicely equipped with an inner pull-out hook clasp on the inner side of the F clasp for the attachment of the accompanying detachable shoulder strap, giving the Fendi First bag multi-purpose carrying options. This means you can wear it on your arm or as a clutch or place it on your shoulder, making the Fendi First bag a very versatile bag, turning it from an everyday on-the-go bag to an evening clutch. The Fendi First bag is available in a wide array of variations, from exotic skins to Napa leather, to playful print-on-print -print fabrics to fur and sherlin, all adding to the stylistic allure of the Fendi First bag. The Fendi First bag also comes in a wide array of colours, from black to mint green to pink and neutral colours. The Fendi First bag is available in a few sizes, including a small and a medium, and there is also the Nano Fendi First charms. The prices of the Fendi First bag starts at upwards of 2150 for the small. The Fendi First bag has a very simple and elegant design, with no embellishments, thrills or decorations. The Fendi First bag is a clean-cut bag, a modern classic clutch with a quirky twist. Its unique shape and structure, finished with precision, makes it more appealing and attractive. The Fendi First bag absolutely captures Fendi House's heritage to create another covetable accessory for the Fendi Fashion House. And at number 7 we have the Hermes Gige bag. With prices starting at upwards of £3,000 for the Gige in the Elan 29 size. The Hermes Gige clutch bags are handmade and assembled 
by skilled artisans who are renowned for their craftsmanship and producing quality leather goods. The Hermes Gige Clutch Bag is a flat envelope shaped bag with a slim, streamlined rectangular silhouette. The front of the clutch is adorned with the iconic Hermes H logo on the front flat top, which also doubles up as the mechanism to secure and close the clutch, with the pull-through crossover strap into the H clasp. The big H makes the clutch an instantly recognisable part of the Hermes collection. And like all Hermes bags, they are hand-stitched using the Hermes signature saddle stitching. The Hermes Gige has previously been available in five different sizes, but today only the Hermes Gige Elan 29 is offered by Hermes. The Gige Elan 29 and the Gige Elan 35 has a more rectangular silhouette, whilst the non-Elans, the PM, the GM, have more squarish silhouettes, and there is also the Mini. The Gige clutch bag is available in a range of different materials, such as canvas, leather, exotic skin, or a combination of the materials, as well as the gorgeous, supple, luxurious, and textured, durable, and somewhat waterproof Epson leather, and the Swift leather and exotic skins. The Swift calfskin leather is an extremely supple, sophisticated leather named after Jonathan Swift, the author of Gulliver's Travel, to highlight its resemblance to Gulliver's calfskin. The leather is smooth and soft with a delicate shine. The Hermes Gige comes in a wide assortment of colours, from primary colours, neutrals to neon colours. The interior of the Hermes Gige opens up to a single gutted compartment with a lambskin interior lining which matches the exterior. The story of the Gige began in the 1970s when Jean Giron, the son-in-law of Emile Hermes, presented the prototype of this clutch to his future daughter-in-law. It is reportedly named after the creator Guerin's initials, hence the name Gige, and said to be a symbol of the union of love. The Hermes Gige is simple but sophisticated, a timeless classic piece. It is a capacious and spacious clutch bag that can be carried handheld or under the crook of the arm. The Gige Elan is the ultimate traditional piece taking you seamlessly from day to night, from a corporate event to an evening soiree. A beautiful style and iconic in design, this clutch will have you turning hairs. The Hermes Gige is one of the most relatively affordable Hermes staple pieces that suits every occasion. The Hermes Gige clutch, a sleek design perfect for any kind of use. The Gige clutch is a very difficult piece to acquire, but to find it in one of the most stunning shades and skins, like Crocodile, is very near impossible. The Hermes Gige Clutch is a highly coveted masterpiece sought after by fashionistas all over the world. The Hermes Gige Elan embodies the epitome of timeless elegance, high quality and quintessential French luxury. The Hermes Gige is a stunning classic piece that will be in your collection for many years to come.